Hello and welcome to this Tarot Advent Series. It's the 13th of December and the card for today is the world. So the world shows this naked woman with a purple sash around her. She's holding these two wands. She's encircled by this green laurel wreath and she's kind of dancing in this in within that circle as if to celebrate or there's something that she's happy about she's come to completion on and it's like she's stepping through it into something new and in the four corners of the card are the fixed signs of the zodiac so the message behind this card is like she is stepping through from one thing into the next she is something has come to completion the circle represents the completion of a journey uh, a laurel wreath is something about celebration and achievement and the ones that she's holding you see these in the the number one card in the tarot which is the magician and that is the start of the manifestation process the magician is envisaging what he wants to create and um, drawing universal energies to that vision. And this card represents it having come to completion. So this is the last card in the major arcana. So it's it's the whole, um, the tarot is known as the journey of the fool. And the fool is, it doesn't have a number. It's the very first card, but it's a zero. And so it's about the trials and tribulations of being human and all of the major arcana cars uh, kind of take you through that journey and this is the completion of something so it's like um the advice of the card is that it's a time to look back like she's looking back before she and her body's moving forward so it's about acknowledging all the things that you have achieved all of the steps that you've taken to get to where you are now there's something it's maybe you were moving up a level in some way or something has come to fruition and there is a new beginning on the horizon the four characters in in the corners the the zodiac symbols they represent the four suits of the tarot they represent the four points of the compass the four seasons the four elements so they're a reminder that you're guided by life from one phase into the next by all of these energies that exist in life. And they symbolize like the harmony and balance of those different um, energies on your journey. So do you need to stop and celebrate before you move on to the, the next phase of life? Do you have something that you've achieved that really needs acknowledging how far you've come? how you've grown, who you've become on the journey. In a more literal sense, it might mean travel. It might mean it's time to bring your gifts out into the world to sort of make, make a bigger difference in the world, to make the world a better place. It could be the birth of a child or the birth of a new project. It could be a marriage or a graduation or the end of a cycle in some way that you're completing that needs to be properly celebrated and it also could be a gentle nudge from the universe that it's time to uh, find some sort of personal closure to something and maybe face an ending because you know when one door closes another always opens so if there's a message for you today in this card then let me know in the comments and I'll see you tomorrow